Hi, I'm Mark Dice, and welcome back to Let's Play Digital Double Saga. I was a busy little bee in between episodes. I've gotten most of his grid down. Um, pretty much all I have to do is the last two heals, and then these two. But uh, I didn't feel like earning another million. Uh, well, another one. About two million, uh, and then four million plus that, and then this guy, which is another six hundred thousand. So that's like almost three million. A little shy, a little shy of three million. Didn't really feel like doing that. Heat, whatever. Uh, Argilla, I actually did a lot of her tree. Um, she now has null element. Um, she's working. No, she's not working on that one. I need more money. Um, yeah, she's working on the rest of her elemental skills. Um, Gale, I think, is the most complete in terms of the outer stuff. He's working on the evil god, so he can be immune to death and all that. And, uh, yeah. He also got null element, so basically elemental magic is worthless for me. Uh, both him and Argilla both got uh, insatiable, and I was insatiabling stuff like crazy and switching around party members to get everything right. Um, but I came to Vanguard's base just because it's the easiest place to get everything done. Uh, to use a vendor and then use a uh, terminal. I was debating fighting the bosses now just to get their mantras, but I think I'm going to wait because I'll pretty much be invincible uh, after this point. And first thing I need to do is turn off my usual um, my usual set. This is that's pretty much the set for just about everybody, um, except for Tentarafu. It you can pretty much auto battle uh, everyone or all the Titanias. It makes it really easy because you don't really have to do much. Um, unless the Arabakis appear, and that's not really a big deal. Um, first thing I want to do... No, I'm going to keep the attack all, so I don't really need a charge. First thing is annoying. First thing I have to do is start equipping all of my elemental magics again. Uh, because we're going to just climb the tower, because... Whatever. I'm climbing the tower, damn tower. Um, actually, I can take the attack all off. I'd rather have Hemo on. And same thing for Gale, except he's going to have a little bit weaker, and then I'll tweak them as I go slowly up the tower. Uh, because, of course, everything changes as you go up the tower, so skills become useless. I'd rather have him as Andine. Um, and basically I'm going to be working on elemental skills as we go up the tower. Because, hey, why not? Yeah, and he'll get death, death, null death soon enough, because I'm going to need that in the tower. So she's probably the next one to learn null death, if I had get enough money in the tower, which I probably won't. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. I just give her a buff for dying. Um, I would take a moment to work on all the combos. I am going to show all the combos. Not right now. Um, I know I'm going to need Coctus again. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll just give her Death Resist and hope for the best. I don't remember what's at the... Well, I remember some of the things at the bottom of the tower. Which, as you haven't already probably guessed, is that we have to go... Did I already pass it? Nope. Oh yeah, I did. Let's go to Nirvana. Sir, the guards won't allow us to enter anymore. If we try, they kill us. What the hell's going on? Yeah, that's not a good sign. The Karma Temple wants to kill me. By the way, I like the parallaxing in the back. 
a little too extreme. That's probably the only minor bug. Uh, get out of my way. Dickbags. Probably should have put an all... Uh, like a Megado or something like that. These guys, because, or at least last word, because these guys have way too many hit points, and they revert people. Which is really irritating. And they're tiny. But, they're immune. Good. Let's go for Mabu. I don't think they can be frozen or stunned. No, no, apparently they can. Just transform. Hope the best. That's probably why I use Buffer Dine on them. Aww. Yeah, and they never get afraid, because they're robots. At least I don't think they get afraid. I don't think you get off of them. Even if you manage to consume them, I don't think they give you any. But I'm not 100% sure about that. But we'll be fighting a lot of them, and they're really irritating. Um, so yeah, it might actually be worth it to put Coctus on. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Fudine, because I don't think there's any other enemies that are ice weak. Ice really is kind of the special child of this game. It really doesn't... There's so few enemies that are weak to it that don't have other weaknesses. So it's like... <sighs> Those without... A code are not permitted to enter. Refusal to comply will result in termination. Stand down. Failsafe override confirmation. Failsafe override confirmation. One without code has been recognized as Cyber Shaman. Welcome back, Mother. That's just mean. Why would you do that? Yeah, you can get killed by them. And you know, I haven't shown you the game, o game over screen yet, but uh, it'll come. It'll come. Just, just give it time. It'll happen. What are you doing up here? Hey, can you feel something inside of your head? Ever since I res received the Atma, I can hear or feel it. It tells me that my true name is James Mason. I hate to ask you this, but can you do me a favor? If you find a girl named Amelia, I need you to tell her something for me. Okay. Thank you. Just tell her, please be happy. That's all. Okay. That has relevance later. Let's go! No, that's not how that works. Well, she obviously can, because nobody's gonna touch her. This is not what's supposed to happen! We're like the kings at the junkyard. They should bow to us. We're the kings now, yeah? Yes, I understand, Gil.
Well then. Now, unlike before, which I'm going to save now. I actually probably should restore. I did use a fair amount of magic points. I will save that save, but uh, it doesn't really matter. Because I can leave the tower at any time. It's just a humongous pain in the ass if I haven't gotten to a terminal. First things first. Uh, actually, I don't think you can go that way. I think you have to talk to these jerks first. All entries forbidden. Leave now or face termination. Get out of my way. I guess if Gale doesn't freeze him, I shouldn't try to freeze him again. Let's get the rest of this just kind of mapped out right here then, shall we? Because that bothers me. I went back and did some other spots that bother me. The second time through, I won't be quite as annoyed by that. Mostly because I'll be rushing through the game. But I might <coughs> also, uh... Mm, no, I can't use my save because I have everything done. We'd have a round table discussion, but I've managed to kill everybody. I do like this. You can still ask about stuff. I already have. Stupid dissemination machine. This isn't more like Fallen, is it this? It is Fallen. Samsara circulation system. Stage 1 process of repurifying discarded information currently in progress. 
Information of destroyed Asuras will be recycled in the Sea of Milk. Yeah, if you know Indian mythology, you kind of have an idea about what's going on here. Sarah's probably going to risk her life or something for our sake. Can't let her do that. So, we enter this world fully developed. That explains the absence of children. Well, yeah, no shit. Do you not comprehend? Where's our Jill and everybody else? Uh-oh. You might want to get that looked at. Your arms are kind of infected. Basuki. Asuras with karma shall not enter the Sea of Milk. That is the Cyber Shaman's will. Leave it once. Well, what are you doing in the Sea of Milk, you butthole? Uh, I think fire. Yep, fire. This will be a short battle. No, devastating 70 damage. It's the only problem with the spell is, is a lot of enemies use it, it takes forever. Just explode already. I don't remember what game it was, but there's a game where every time you use a spell, it slowly shortens until it's like that. You don't even really see it unless you put the setting on. I don't remember what game. That was a setting I thoroughly enjoyed. It's like sitting through Final Fantasy VII weapon battles. It's like, oh god. Healing time. I thought I was being quiet and you might have had weird rough rustling sound. I heard a weird sound, but I didn't know if it was my phone ringing or something, but my phone should be in this room, it's in the other room. Um, but no, it was just a bird being incredibly crazy. Yeah, I probably could have fired him. I knew this one was coming. Um, but I wasn't sure if it was fire. Yeah, but you look stupid now. I think the only thing I want to get from the extra bosses uh, would probably be no ailments. I'm pretty sure this is going to have no ailments. I think you have to beat one of the bosses in order to get it. See if I had uh, the ultimate fire one, but I don't. Oh uh, yeah, just heal people because I think they'll do a nastier attack if you let it. Yeah, you get recycled fish. Yeah, one hundred fifty thousand. That's really drops in the bucket. Okay, well, they don't say anything. Uh, actually... I think I have to use one. Because I think there's another boss coming up, if I'm remembering correctly. 
seriously it'd be better to just have Cielo fly out. Ow, oh, of course. Like, just bust a hole in the top of the elevator and fly all the way to the top. That'd probably be the easier way to go. Just saying. And I know I'm gonna have to cut some of the climbing the Karma Tower into split episodes. Uh, just because of how big uh, parts of it are. Because uh, I know that there's not a lot of save points in between places. These guys are believably into fire as well. Shield ice, good to know. Oh, Zan. Oh, look at you, Mr. Fancy Dance Pants. Yeah, way to miss Gale. Hold. Or maybe that's their secret that they're big pansies. Can't take hits. Yeah, I kind of put Surf's strength up a little bit between farming for strength things and uh, putting it up so he'd attack faster. I mean, I should put his agility up so he can actually hit something, but screw that. Anyway, I think on the way up here, there's uh, something that drops agility noise. I put it on for grinding. It's not helpful now. Now it'll just piss me off. Auto repeat off. No. Stupid oh, confirm. Confirm this bitch. Item. Hey, there's a strange object. Let's touch it. HP noise. Normally, you'd give HP noise to Argella just because. Ugh, you again. Oh, yeah, derp. That heals me. Oh, I'll have to fix that. Let's do an exploratory turn and fix her function. Hell death, drain ice, and all ailments. Well, that's kind of lame. Uh, let's do Mazianda. Yeah, I know you can uh, bloodbath him and stuff like that. Or uh, you use really powerful physical attacks are not very effective, but yeah. That's a problem. If he keeps casting Fizz he can't do anything when he's frozen. Which is basically what I'm trying to do. Now I think he summons another one. I'll try to eat it or have it heal. Here your friends. Aw, oh, look at him so sad. Sad dancing. Consuming a nip hugger is a pain because you could insatiable, insatiable him or consume him forever. And uh, yeah, it still takes goddamn forever. I just want you to be zapped or Well, whatever, you're dead anyway. Actually, I think you can expel him. Actually. 
Yeah, I probably should have tried to expel him. Probably would have been more effective. Whatever. He's dead now. Moving on. Oh, Garamakala, my least favorite. We will continue this in the next episode of Let's Play Digital Devil Saga with me, Morik Dice. See you later.